Mark Polderman and Robert Hoffman are water millers. It's their job to keep the windmills in tip-top shape. In the 18th century, Dutch engineers pioneered innovative machines to protect the country from disastrous flooding. They constructed dikes around the land, then built windmills on the banks to pump water from the fields into the waterways to keep the fields dry. These 19 windmills of the Kinderdijk are the largest collection still standing. Mark Polderman and Robert Hoffman are water millers. It's their job to keep the windmills in tip-top shape. Remarkably, the Kinderdijk windmills are still used to control flood water, and they work with the power of wind alone just as they did over 250 years ago. The sails of the windmill drive a system of gears and shafts that turn a water wheel. The wheel pushes water from the low-lying floodplain up to the level of the raised waterway, from where it eventually flows out to sea. You see the blades are turning and the pump as well. This is very beautiful to see, especially with this kind of weather. There is water, there is sun, there is wind. Just perfect. Under their guardianship, the Kinderdijk windmills should continue to stand proud for another 300 years.